Imagine the world where the cracks in our roads, bridges and the buildings repair themselves, just like a wound healing on the human skin. No constant patchwork, no endless maintenance, no fear of collapsing structures. It sounds like science fiction, right? But this is exactly what engineers are bringing to life with self-healing concrete. Today we are gonna discuss about a revolutionary material that could change the future of construction forever. Concrete is backbone of our cities, used in highways, dams, skyscrapers and even our homes. But here is the issue. Concrete is stronger in compression but weak in tension. Over the period of time, tiny cracks appear from stress, weather and chemical process. These cracks let the water and oxygen in the concrete and leading to corrosion of steel reinforcement and expensive structural damage. In fact, billions of dollars worldwide are spent every year and expensive structural damage create structures. That's where the self-healing technology can help us. So how does concrete heal itself? Researchers have developed several fascinating methods. So the first method is bacteria-based healing. So special bacteria spores are mixed into the concrete. When cracks form and water seeps in, the bacteria wakes up and produces limestone, which fills and seals the crack initially. The second method is microcapsules of healing agents. So scientists are using the tiny capsules containing glue-like substances that are embedded inside the concrete. When the crack opens, the capsule breaks, releasing the healing liquid that hardens and closes the gap. The third method is shape memory polymer and fibers. So by the use of advanced materials that can expand and swell when exposed to moisture, they close the cracks automatically. This technology has already been tested around the world. In the Netherlands, the bridges have been built with bacteria-based self-healing concrete. In the UK, highways are experimenting with capsules that can seal the cracks as soon as they appear. Even the large infrastructures like tunnels, dams and coastal defenses our primary use this. Imagine a dam that seals as it leaks, or a skyscraper that doesn't need patching work for decades. The potential cost saving and safety improvements are really massive. The real impact of self-healing concrete lies its inability to extend over the lifespan of our structures while reducing the maintenance cost. Instead of constantly patching up the cracks or rebuilding the damaged sections, we could have bridges, roads and buildings that remain strong for decades longer than today. This not only saves governments and taxpayers billions but also makes our infrastructure far safer by reducing the risk of sudden failures. Because the few repairs are needed, it is also going to lower the carbon emissions. The production of cement is one of the largest contributors to greenhouse gas emissions. So the whole idea here is the self-healing concrete doesn't just make for construction, it is cheaper and much safer. Self-healing concrete is more than just a new material. It is just a glimpse of the future of the civil engineering where our buildings and the bridges behave like a living organisms. As we are moving forwards in the world where the infrastructure doesn't just stand still, it has to repair, adapt and evolve itself. So the next time when you are driving over a bridge or walking over a pavement, think about this. In few years, those cracks that you might see are gonna disappear on their own. If you found this video fascinating then don't forget to subscribe our channel for more videos.